Well, there appears to be a big drive for public transport at the moment, doesn't there? They're trying to make life as difficult as they can for cars and drivers with taxis here and congestion charges there and ULES fares in other places. It's getting very difficult. And of course, if you want to push people down the public transport route, you need affordable fares, you need reliable service. After all, otherwise it's not worth doing. Well, from next year, uh, pa bus passengers are going to see a price cap of two quid on a single journey. How do everybody? Welcome back to the channel for Sunday. Hope you're doing all right. I'm not too bad, not too bad. Let me know uh, you're okay in the comments below and uh, what you're going to be up to today. That'd be cool. Well, yes, bus passengers. Yeah, you know, the shiny red things. You never get enough of them, and when you don't want them, five turn up at once. Well, yeah. Uh, from next year, it's going to be cheaper to get on them. Uh, bus passengers are going to see the fares capped at just two quid. So it looks like they're trying to actively encourage this happening. Uh, Transport Secretary Grant Schatz is going to provide 60 million quid in funding. So, you know, these bus operators can limit their prices. They're saying it's to help with the financial squeeze. I, I'm not convinced of that. I think they just want to encourage people on them and out of their cars, to be quite honest. Uh, they're saying they want to make it cheaper to get to work, schools, shops and everything for the first three months of 2023. So this isn't a permanent uh, change. It's literally for the first three months. And, uh, you know, it, it, it will help lower the cost of that transport. At the moment, and, uh, you know, we're talking about TfL London, the average trip, th uh, uh, three mile trip currently costs £2.80. And uh, there is a flat rate uh, in TfL of 165 if made within an hour. Uh, the £2 cap uh, will work the same idea as TfL bus fares and it will save Brits quite a hefty sum. Uh, the move means that lengthy journeys could be cut uh, as well because some tickets, uh, depending on where you go, can be as much as about 19 quid. Uh, I mean, as an example here, it costs £12 for a day ticket from Peterborough to Norwich with First XL and £19 from Leeds to the coastal town of Whitby. And under this scheme, both of those will just cost two quid. Uh, so, you know, that's a, that's a hell of a reduction in all the fares. So, you know, we'll see if this funding's forthcoming. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Uh, are you up for it? Or do you see more to this than meets the eye? I think I do, I'm afraid. But it'd uh, be interesting to see your feedback. Anyway, toodaloo.